Welcome to the first LP of the Callan Rose YouTube channel. Uh, we'll be playing Scott Pilgrim vs. The World, the game, and we're going to introduce ourselves. You first, sir. I'm withheld McFake name, and I'll be playing as Stephen Stills in the red shirt. Okay, and you are? I am Banshee, and I'll be playing as Ramona. Okay, and you will be your least favourite. No, I will not. <laughs> and I am Liquid Pilgrim, and I'll be playing as Scott Pilgrim, the mm. protagonist of this story, and Ramona's love interest. Which I'm sorry, withheld. You have to get cut out of that beautiful little story arc. Yeah, yeah, yeah it's rough. You just go off with your little Damn. bearded friend. Why are you looking to see if I was pointing to a bearded person? I was talking about Joseph from Scott Pilgrim. <laughs> I thought you may have been a poster up there. No, no. He wasn't in the movie. So he wasn't no, yeah. Sure. It was really a really small character in the comics. Those who don't know, we're talking about um, the character that turns out to be Stephen Stills' boyfriend in the comics, uh, Joseph. Who very very small character, but uh, yeah, if you don't know much about the Scott Pilgrim universe, uh, I hope you've been watching this intro because it gives you a basic understanding. And running in there from the left, you saw all the characters, which is Scott, Ramona, Stephen Stills, and Kim Pine. And if you beat the game with all of them, you unlock Nega Scott, which is the only character yet to be I've, I've yet to use to complete the story, which isn't relevant. I don't know why I keep saying. Uh, we're going to play through this in Supreme Master because we're all at level 16. Which is the highest in the game. Yeah, it's the highest in the game, that level. Uh, the, this, yeah. uh, we're trying to get through it quickly, but we also want it to be somewhat challenging, so Supreme Master seems like the best choice. Yeah. And uh, unlike a lot of games, the level you're at doesn't actually affect your strength, your stats, or whatever. Uh, uh, getting up levels only affects the moves you can use. So we've got. Uh, uh, you, we've got every move you can get, including, I think we've all bought the secret move from Mobile, and his, except from Banshee actually, I don't think I'm you've bought it. I'm already, I'd also like to point out, I'm, you have to pick me up, I'm handicapped here because I have no lives. Okay, so we're starting from Ramona from zero lives, but we'll try and protect and her. And uh, still from two lives. Yes. Of the last yeah. time you ran through this. But yeah, as I was saying, you uh, money is very important in this game because you can't unlock, uh, you can't get your stats up through leveling up. You have to physically buy them from shops and, uh, and such like that, uh, so money is very important. Uh, but we should get going. And I think um, Scott's the only one with fully maxed out stats. Um, yeah. Ramona and Stills, I think, have some willpower, some def I think it's 30 willpower, 30 defense, and 30 speed, I'm not sure. Whereas Scott's at full 100. And uh, we, we agree on this all the time. The music in this game by Anna Managuchi is absolutely fantastic. Oh, don't jump in the hole. It's, it's absolutely fantastic. It's, uh, they, they also did a song or two for the movie, if I'm not mistaken. Uh, which I think it was just credit songs, but still, Anna Managuchi. Oh, I picked you up. I like you jump. Yeah, uh, that's actually something that we're going to end up getting annoyed about. Uh, each other up, yeah, we're, we're going to end up picking each other up and oh, throwing no. them and throwing them across the screen, Nuts. injuring them. It'll happen a few times, no doubt. As you'll notice, the the first boss for uh, this game is Matthew Patel, and as you can see on the side of the bus, Lucas Lee is number two. Uh, oh, I didn't notice there were people here. And uh, we're going to work our way up to the seven evil X's. Obviously, for those un unfamiliar with the Scott Pilgrim universe, there are seven evil exes. It said that in the intro. Yes, well. So they already still, know that. Yes, well, but I, I'm getting to a point. There are seven evil exes, but two, point of, two of them. Are, shut up. Two of them appear at the uh, at the same time, the Kai and Aggie twins. So there are actually six levels of evil exes and uh, an extra level to fight Nega Scott, who is unlocked later, which I've already said. Getting repetitive already, I think. But yes, I was building up to my point with him that uh, two appear at the same time. I wasn't just going to yeah, repeat myself. Yeah, you take seriously. I'm sorry. And I'm just... Uh, Thankfully, these two guys will just start letting Yes. Uh, as you can see, I'm getting a combo hit, and I've just beat Scott's uh, combo hit by one. Because uh, in the comic and in the, uh, I think in the movie as well, no. uh, well, it, it does show you his combo in the movie. Yeah, but, but it doesn't yeah. say how it's his best. In, uh, in the comic, it tells you how when Scott combos Matthew Patel, he gets a 64 hit combo, which uh, Stephen Stills, I think, is it? I think it still says that's his best yet. No, uh, Wallace says it. Okay, well, Wallace says it. Because Wallace is like his trainer. Yeah. Well, uh, Wallace says that he got a 64 hit combo, which is his best. And then. Um, Wallace's roommate. Yeah. 
as you as as you uh, as Stills is doing right now, he's glowing gold. It gives you a burst of speed and strength and defense and all that. And uh, when you grab someone to combo them, it gives you a counter for their combo moves instead of just letting you pound the shit into them for ages. And Stills actually, our friend Withheld here, has um, the highest of all of us, the highest combo of all of us, which is 396. And he's very proud of that, as he should be, because it's quite awesome. Yep, the ladies love it, I'm sure. <laughs> Uh, the subspace highway door coming up after these dogs. Thank you. Uh, how are you doing again? I'm you. Get the dogs off me. Oh, yep. Okay. And, as you saw there, uh, that I was reviving Ramona. I think that was the second time I revived you. Um, yeah. Yeah. Uh, each character has their own, whoop, has their own sort of animation when they're reviving someone. Scott makes some little puppy dog guy face. And uh, depending on how many times you mash B to revive someone, that affects how much health they get when they are revived. It's around 5 HP for Crash. I think you're the only person that's remembered that, which is good because I don't. Yeah. Because you know. I, I, I keep wanting to get the technical details, but I couldn't remember that, so thanks. <laughs> so, in the sub There is there. Ramona's cat, Gideon, right beside the door, but that hipster dude's blocking him. Oh, there is hipsters in level 1. Yeah, yeah. Well, With well, the shutter shades, who all suck. I'm wearing short shade right now. I'm Turn to check again. <laughs> yeah, I don't know why I turned to check again. I, I did. Oh, I, oh, I pigs. I did. I'm shivering enough. I'm, I think I'm mumbling a lot, so people are going to find it hard to understand what I'm saying. Definitely. We have Scottish accents, they're already going to find it hard to understand. Except you, saying. who's apparently Australian. I'll never be as yeah. bad as that guy doing Resident Evil 4. Oh, yeah. But yes, uh, oh, that's I don't good. know. I'm down. To be fair, none of our uh, our LPs will be as bad as that uh, that guy who did a an LP. Of, oh god damn it! Of uh, Zelda: Link to the Past, and he failed at the name input screen. No one's going to be as so bad much. as that guy. Yeah. What's that? What he say? Oh, do wrong. He uh, he tried to put in his name, and uh, he, he put in something wrong, and then he had to reset the emulator. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So we can all. Oh, sorry. I can all agree we're better than that person. I sent him hate mail. <laughs> like right now I'm on my phone and I'm sending him hate mail. You turned to check again. I know, I don't know why. <laughs> so stupid. I'm not gullible, I don't know. No, you're just stupid. Yeah, I'm just stupid. Damn it. Uh, here in the background, standing next to the fire hydrant, is a uh, young Neil. Uh, one of the characters from the game in the comics. In the movie. Um, yeah, sorry, yeah, from the movie in the comics. Uh, in the movie played by Johnny Simmons, great actor, and um, he, he, he plays young Neil immensely. It's, it's so big. Immensely. Immensely. He, yes. he's, a very, he's a very fat job of playing young Neil. Yes. He does a very big job. Shut up. He does a great job of playing young Neil, okay? I'll just say that. And Young Neil and Scott are, I think, the only two main characters in the comic who don't turn out to be gay at the end. Apart from Jim. I said male. No, you didn't. I did. Said 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 I said male. Oh, I think you said male. I said main male. No, we're not. I didn't mean to. <laughs> I really, I love the music by this. Uh, by I might get you. Oh, bus comes here. Um, there is Mrs. Chow. That's a. Uh, oh, that's Kim Pine's. Kim Pine? That's uh, Chow's that's Knives Chow's. That's Knives Chow's mum, uh, who's the first girlfriend of Scott Pilgrim, we actually meet in the comics yep. and things. And, um, and she's in this. She yep, there she is, throwing knives at people. Frame cover for me as I manage to die at the same time. And I also need revive. I'm trying to. Revive, I'm, I'm trying to, but I'm getting revive, punched. Need revive, there we go. Revive, there we go. Thank God. Um, you'll see, I was down there, but I got uh, revived when I, I shouldn't have. That, that's um, because Free hit combo. the 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 blue numbers underneath the yellow numbers at the top, the yellow uh, numbers are your health points, and uh, the blue is the amount of gut points you have. And gut points are taken off when you use your special move, which for Scott is this. That's six gut points Ramona's away, and then um, is this. Oh, and Ramona's. I oh, you've got no gut points. When you've got no oh, gut points, you can use them, yes. but they lower your health. Um, and you have seven health, so don't show your Yeah. Um, Just buy a brother. Yes. As I was saying, 
Oh, it was meant to go. Oh, it, go. see, he took that to go, so that means he has a res has a reserve item. Yep. So what? Uh, will she take that? She'll take that when she dies, I think. Yeah. Yeah. But uh, as I was saying, and I got interrupted a few times. Uh, gut Sorry. points as well as affecting the special you can use uh, if you get knocked down and injured. Uh, if you get knocked down and have to be revived, gut point. If you have gut points, you'll be revived instantly. At the, obviously, it'll take away some gut points, uh, which is really good because it uh, it's much easier than having to be revived by your teammates constantly, which uh, isn't really effective for Ramona considering Vanshee always needs to be revived. <laughs> but I suppose that's sort of our fault because you don't have those stats. Yeah, and I don't have. Look, as you can see, the epic burst help. of speed that uh, Scott gets when he's glowing gold, as opposed to when he turns back to normal. You'll see in a minute when he turns back to normal. That was quite easy. Oh. Yeah, I, li I, do, I, li I do like the amount of uh, different enemies you get in this game. You, you get a fair few variations of hipsters, though, as well as emos and tanky guys and dogs. And film rappers, crew. yeah, and film crew, and fat guys, and dinosaur and people with shades, and dinosaur aliens, yes. Well, no, dinosaurs and aliens, not a mix of both. Yeah, I know. The yeah, way you said it, Kim, you, 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 you take aliens. things so seriously. God, fucking Jace, Jace, Christ. No, I thought you just fucked up when you said it. I did. All oh, right. See, that's you. <laughs> God damn it. We Yeah, oh, yes. <laughs> yes, uh, one of the f number, number of uh, game references, obviously Mario, that you get in the uh, comics. Uh, as you seen when we were in the, the shop a minute ago where Vanshee bought uh, Ambrosia, there was uh, an upgrade you could have got called the Never Ending Fantasy, obviously a uh, Final Fantasy reference, and Speedy the Porcupine. Uh, sorry the Hedgehog, clearly. And um, you, you do, here's the first boss fight coming up, I'll get back to what I'll say in a second. Matthew Patel, uh, you can read his stats. As they appear in a second, but um, there's Some crashing the boys, crashing, crashing the boys, boys uh, an old game, yeah. as well as um, Clash of Demon Head, uh -huh. another old reference, game. and you can buy an upgrade uh, reference to the Smashing Pump uh, Pumpkins, which I'm sure there were a couple of Smashing Pumpkin songs played in the movie. Uh, there th weren't. Were there not? There weren't any Smashing Pumpkin songs played. Oh in no, the no, movie. sorry. There was a uh, there. There is a reference in the comic to the Smashing Pumpkin. Yeah, the third sorry. comic is named uh, Scott Pilgrim and Infinite Sadness. Yeah. After Melancholy and Infinite Sadness. And a couple, actually, a couple of the um, T-shirts that Scott wears in the movie, it wears in the movie is uh, a reference to Smashing Pumpkins. Uh, but yeah, tell of Demon Hips checks. Yes. And fireballs. Uh, full combo. But there's a an album just you can buy like in, this. in the other media. Yeah. There's a, there's an album you can buy in this called um, the Smashing Turnips, which obviously another reference to the Smashing Pumpkins. And here we'll see everybody's exit sequence. Trying to spread out a lot. Yep. Uh, Stills is by far the best, I think, and Scott's is just the most mediocre. The Ramona's is pretty good as well. Yeah. Scott's is the only one that really sucks. Coin Hunter. I am very okay. Always the pacifist, aren't you? Ah, oh, indeed. Yeah. Such a nice guy. You're just a dick. And this is one of the many transitional between level cutscene things. That just consists of Scott and Ramona making out and the other characters looking pissed off. It's good. More bored than anything. Yeah. Uh, Castle Lambda film set. Castle Lambda is the second level. Well, yes, but yeah. I, was, I was going to <laughs> say uh, from obviously the comics and the movies, uh, Quite a, I think quite a lot of uh, films that are filmed in that Canada are actually filmed in Castle Lambda because I, I remember Castle Lambda. Ca oh, sorry, uh, yeah, but ca um, Castle Loma because I, I remember hearing something about said about that in the Scott Pilgrim commentary, one of the Scott Pilgrim commentaries. Uh, though we just c came across another enemy there. That oh, there's Lisa Miller and Holly from the 